Coat's back. Hey guys! It's your friend Lo here. So I know what you're thinking. Why the Carhartt hat, Lo? To that, I would say we have a big winter storm coming through the area. Seven to eight inches. Really not that much, but I have a ton of errands that I would like to do. That was a little dramatic. When I said I was gonna take you along to do errands, what I meant was I have a $50 gift card to Home Goods and I wanna go spend it. Let's go. <laughs> We need to go to camera corner. I want to find a new backdrop after that home goods And we're gonna try to do all of this before my husband gets home from work Wow cut me off you I'm talking to you oh, grandma. Where the frick is camera corner? Is Starbucks before camera corner? Great. Oh no! I forgot my reusable straw. One of my best friends Tori bought me it I've been using it like crazy, but I forgot it, so I'm gonna have to get a plastic straw. I will upcycle it into a bracelet, and I will give it away to one of you. By give it away, I mean I will figure out one of your addresses and send it to you. I know you don't want it, but it's a gift, and now you have to keep it forever. You're welcome. I have a YouTube channel called Artist Called Low. Follow me, subscribe. He didn't care. He was sassy. He didn't make eye contact with me. You win some, you lose some. I know what I can talk about. My subscribers. Just like a couple days ago, had 130, up past 150. That's so cool. I never imagined anyone would watch these videos. I know some people might say, Why are you so excited about 150 subscribers? And to that, I would say, because that's a big freaking deal. You know, 2019, I'm gonna definitely be collabing with Shane Dawson. Him and Ryland are probably gonna ask me to move in with them. I don't know. It's a whole thing. We haven't really worked out logistics yet. By logistics, I mean I have not met them. They do not know I exist. It's fine. Can't wait to send you guys a bracelet. Oh, sorry. God. Oh, my sister texted me. I love it when my sister texts me. I'm going to have to pause this entire thing to text her back. All right, so I'm going to go in now. Well, that was a lot of money I didn't have. I got a backdrop. I need this backdrop. One down, guys. I do love that place, though. It is a great camera place. It's where I go for all my camera stuff. Backdrops were a little expensive there. I could have gotten it cheaper online. Small business, and they deserve the 20 extra dollars that they made off of me. The best part about going to Home Goods right now is that I don't have to spend my actual money. Shout out to my Aunt Kelly, who got me this gift card. You the real MVP. On week like 12 of my radio being broken. Did I go the wrong way? Do I know where Home Goods is? Oh, okay. So, like, some of you have messaged me and been like, hey, were you a drama kid? Yeah, I kind of was. I was kind of like a drama kid groupie. What do I mean by that? I mean, I never actually performed really. I did like a couple things, but I mainly just like asserted myself into the theater kids group. Why? Because theater kids are the coolest kids that you will ever hang out with. What's so cool about theater kids? They're goofy, they're the funniest kids in the entire school. They're fun, they aren't afraid to be boisterous and loud. I love that. At my high school, we had a speech team. I mean, again, I was like a groupie and I never actually like competed or anything. Mr. Thomas was an awesome teacher and an awesome speech coach. He just let me come along for the ride. So they would like travel across the state and I just got to go with. He was maybe hoping that I would compete. I never did and it's one thing I regret. My best time in high school was doing that. The team did this group performance. I think it was called In the Round. Insert different name. He was the one of the leads in it. And if we're gonna be honest, I definitely had the biggest crush. He's now happily married to the man of his dreams. I did go to prom with him. Um, I don't know if he's still doing acting, but he was the most phenomenal actor I had ever met in my entire life. To answer the question, was I a drama kid? I don't know, kind of, maybe, not really. I just wanted to be one. Would you look at that? Let's go inside and hopefully they don't kick me out. Looking for the clearance section. Ta -dun, ta -dun, ta -dun. I can honestly say I'm, I'm not quite sure what I'm doing here. I do know that um, I have room for none of this furniture. None of this would fit in my house. It is also all about five times um, the amount of what my gift card is. So I'm just kind of trying to blend with my surroundings. There's a lot of rich people here. I'm pretending I have more money than I do. 
off to another clearance section. Um, I would give it about 10 seconds before my dogs completely ruined them. Okay, freaking update. I'm I'm sweating. I did not find anything. After spending an hour in that store, my brain had this idea that Home Good is also owned by the same company family as TJ Maxx, and TJ Maxx is cheaper. So I'm gonna go to TJ Maxx. Oh no, we're about to pass the Taco Bell. You don't need Taco Bell. It's not good for you. Why is your turn signal on? Could I get a Double Decker Supreme Taco? Comment below if you like spicy food. Now that I'm 26, I think I've just slowly deteriorating my taste buds with poor life decisions. I love spicy stuff now. Taco Bell mukbang. Let me just say, if you do not know what a Double Decker Supreme is, you are missing out, my friend. They take a hard shell and then they coat that hard shell in refried bean. I know you think, how could they possibly do more? They do. They add a soft shell on top of that. Cool. I'm a messy eater. Good luck, everybody. I'm coming over. Do you think that Taco Bell's Diablo sauce is even hot? Because I don't. Spilled on my pants. Don't judge me. I'm going! Shut up! Oh god, I hope that lady that honked at me is gonna be in TJ Maxx. I just wanna go up to her and be like, I hope you have a really nice day. Kill him with kindness, folks. Nope, just as I suspected, she's going into Old Navy. All right, let's go. Alexis, are you registered? Please stand by for the next question. TJ Maxx was a freaking success, let me tell ya. I got a sheet set as well as a pink blanket. So I mean, I basically am Amber Filler up now, like living my best life. Story time. Someone freaking recognized me in there. What is my life? Perusing down the aisles. I walked by this girl and I smiled at her and she smiled back. And then I'm back to focusing on my shopping and I hear an excuse me. I turn around and it was the girl I had smiled at and she was like, I just want to let you know, like I really like your work. Keep it up. She freaking recognized me from inside. Instagram. I about cried. She was like, oh, this is so cute. You're turning red. I'm like, yeah, dude, because this is the first time this has ever happened. Thank you. Can't wait to tell my husband about that. She's also an illustrator from the area. Her name uh, on Instagram is at Callie Cat. I got the cutest pink duvet and sheet set that my husband will probably hate, but whatever. I'm kind of curious to see what my hair looks like underneath this hat that I've been wearing all day. Oh, nope, it's bad. Put that back on. Oh, no. There's my YMCA, and that's the gym that I go to. By go to, I mean I have a membership and I've gone one time. It's called Fitness, honey. I'm a very nice person, and then I get behind the wheel of a car, and I turn into an aggressive monster. Green means go, bud. Nice turn signal. Oh, oh, my husband's home. Shoot. I thought I was going to be able to sneak all this stuff in. Nope. I wasn't shopping. I never go shopping. That is freaking wholesome content right there. As promised, here is the upcycled Starbucks straw bracelet. Rowie is a lovely model of it. I guess all I have to say now is you better hope that your addresses aren't online because someone is going to get this. It's going to be yours. And here we have the seamless backdrop that I bought. So yeah. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you comment below, let me know what you think, hit that subscribe button, and please hit that bell button so you are always notified when I release a new video. And in the rare chance that you just can't get enough of me, here are my socials. Follow along with my everyday shenanigans and you know, just like my stuff. Be my friend, no really, please be my friend, I need friends.